And specifically, we see the coercion to disconnect people from God playing out in all kinds of propaganda, the gender ideology propaganda, where we're, they're attempting to get people to believe that God made mistakes, which is a, a fascinating way to basically get people to not believe in God, because if you believe in God, you probably believe God doesn't make too many mistakes. Like, hey, uh, look at this junk between my legs. I'm the wrong gender. So <laughs> they try to teach us your mind, what you want. You are right. God's wrong. God made a mistake. Dude, you're totally right about your, you, you should be a woman. God made a mistake. So, you know, there probably is no God. But when we see all this gender ideology stuff that hinges on that principle that there probably was a God, he wouldn't be screwing up your gender now, would he? We see that coming at our kids all the time. And amongst other devious intentions behind that kind of ideology, I believe one of the principal ones at its core is to disconnect people from their faith in God.